the right at the top is the cerebral cortex part of the cerebrum cerebrum as a whole is cerebral cortex plus the deeply embedded basal ganglia basal ganglia are defined in anatomy books as part of the cerebrum okay so it's it's cerebral cortex that thick cone like layer of the cortex which is uh, the the famous face of the brain for the lay, lay people whenever they uh, uh, want to make a picture of the brain it's the what they picture is actually the cerebral cortex the outermost part that that is that can be visualized of the human brain and you know that it has a lot of convolutions it's not it's not a smooth thing and there's a reason for that they cover a lot of surface area because there's a lot of stuff coming into it and coming out of it so there's a lot of surface area that needs to be covered uh, but the space in the skull is of course limited just like the lungs lungs huge surface area covered but the thorax has a limited uh, limited area so what do they do they make lots and lots of angular so this is the the marvel of engineering same sequence happens in the brain the convolutions that you see on top of the cerebral cortex is actually to to conserve area the limitation of the area to increase surface area but let 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 it be known that the surface of the cortex is very very large to give you some perspective the you know the difference between white matter and gray matter white matter are the the the, the transmitting cords the ascending and descending pathways simply put okay gray matter is the the cell body of the neurons and its dendrites they stain as gray darker than the white stuff all right so a stat interesting stat about the white matter is if you were to take out the white matter of the cerebrum and connect it end to end you know how long that distance can be from the earth to the moon one human being how interesting is that so you are carrying in only a part of your body so much wires that if they connect end to end it's literally from the moon to earth it's not this can you imagine and how it's distributed and how it's sort of i can't find a word just fit into tucked into designed or engineered into one part of not just a part of the body one part of a part i e the brain we're not talking about the spinal cord the brain the cerebrum that part kitne number five is anyhow 